The Groundlings are not just an improv school. It's also home to a world-renowned troupe of comedy greats that continue to perform on a weekly basis. I'm Michaela Watkins. I am a current member of the Groundlings. I guess for me, I just couldn't not do it when I found out what it was. I mean, I'd done improv in college and I'd done it right after college, you know, in the Northwest. And so when I came here and moved to LA and somebody told me what Groundlings was, immediately when they, they said how you start out with improv and then how you start writing for yourself, I thought, God, that is so empowering. My name is Mindy Sterling, and I am an alumni. I come back and I do improv shows. I teach a little bit here and there. I loved the idea of playing, and I loved the idea of making choices without having a script and not without someone saying, do that. I kind of wanted to do whatever I wanted to do, and so I had taken other improv classes that led me here. You're the writer, you're the stagehand, you're the actor. There's a blank canvas and you're just being able to produce all of this just on the fly. And it's in the moment. Ruth and I have been talking. We feel like you're feeling self-conscious for expelling air yesterday from your butthole while you were <laughs> We just want you to know it's natural. I've never lost control before. When you're in the character, you're not aware of whether it's funny. And so you just have to find the unique little synapses that make this character fire. It's their point of view. That's really important about the character. It's not how big, broad, or little. It's their point of view. And the funny comes out of the realness. The only way that the improv can stay afloat and function is if the two people are connected and really listening to each other and building off of what the other person is saying and doing. So you can only build off what they're doing if you're listening, and you can only listen if you're present, you're not planning in your head. I mean, I think the art is being creative and create something from nothing and be able to trust whoever it is that you're working with and trust yourself and create this you know, living environment from that. The art, I think, is also that it's one of a kind. It's held in one moment. It can never yes. be repeated. And it can never be the same thing if produced by another person. In other words, what I would improvise and what Mindy would improvise are going to be entirely different. 